What's up guys? This is Bombman2205. Welcome back to the Kanto Expansion Pack one final time. We're here for the Elite Four. So, <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. So, I, I, I don't have time to grind properly. I was like, oh, I'm a bit underleveled, I'm gonna grind the team up. Um, I don't have the time to grind them properly, so I was like, you know what, I'm at the end of the game, no one's gonna mind. I'll just, I'll just hack in some rare candies just to, just to, just to level everybody up a bit. Uh, it seems <laughs> that the regular cheat codes do not work for this ROM hack. And, uh, the missing no glitch has been fixed as well, apparently, it seems. I spent, like, five solid minutes going backwards and forwards on Cinnabar Island, like, replicating the glitch, and it did not like, no Pokemon appeared. So, uh, it looks like, um, that's not an option for me. So, I have six rare candies, and, uh, we are going to use one candy per Pokemon. And we're just gonna hope that we're good enough <laughs> to beat the game. If we play to our type advantages, we should be fine. I'm a bit nervous, though. Um, but hey, we'll see what happens. And I will just spend, like, the rest of my money. I already bought a bunch of revives and full restores and full heals. I'm just gonna buy a whole ton more. Um, and we will see how we go. Just, just more. More max potions. More revives. And I guess one more full heal. Okay, one more thing we need to do is I've got all of my HP ups and stuff. I feel like, as I said before, Ninetales and Flychew I think we're going to be using the most. So let's try and prioritize those two. Um, we'll give one... We'll give one to Nidoran as well. He's probably going to come in handy. Um, let's see. What else have we got? Iron. What does that one do? Defense of a Pokemon. We'll go again. We'll go Ninetales and Flychew. And let's go Umbreon. This is probably going to come in handy at some point, right? Right? I don't know. Calcium. That's special. Okay. Again, that's definitely going to be Ninetales and Flychew and I'm actually going to go Ninetales again. Ether. Oh, we're supposed to be. How did I only find one Ether, by the way? Like that—that that just seems crazy to me. Let's PP up Ice Beam. I know what that one does. And Carbos is speed. Nine tails, sure. Alright, now let's just do one more quick heal. And <laughs> if this goes horribly wrong, you're not going to be seeing this take. And I'm actually going to have to pull an all-nighter tonight, just like leveling up my team. So... Here we go! Welcome- Oh god, who am I leading with? Oh no, it's, it's already off to a terrible start. I'm leading with Guardia, aren't I? Against the Ice type. Oh my god, rookie mistake right off the bat. I've messed this up. Nidorain. Okay, that's- That's not as bad, actually. Actually? This is fine. Um... Because you're not a ground type. You're a rock type, though, so that, yeah, yeah I, didn't, I didn't think this through, did I? Tank it, Nidorain! Tank it! <gasps> Nidorain! What a boss! Alright, Cloyster. Alright! <laughs> you did good, Nidorain! You did good!
Okay. Boo! What the heck is that? What the heck is that? I've never seen this thing before in my life. Um... No, really, what are you? Let's just see what it does. Okay. Okay. Jinx? Okay. Let's get Umbreon out. And you know what, Umbreon, since I'm confident you can tank a hit from this Jinx, I am just going to drop a Hyper Potion on Flytu. Didn't even need to tank a hit. Good job, Jinx. <laughs> Good job. Okay, Glaceon. Mm. You know what I should have done? I should have used a full restore on Nidoran. You know what? I will! Because again, Umbreon can tank a hit. I want to try and cheese this Glaceon. Will we be successful? No, we got a critical hit. Never mind. <laughs> yes! Okay, there goes Glaceon. One more Lapras. Alright, Flychu, finish this. Okay. I was expecting that to do more. Okay, we're fine. Plus, it's got to recharge the Hyper Beam anyway, so even if this doesn't kill. Okay, that wasn't terrible. There are still four more to go, though. So that makes me a little nervous. Alright. Hyper Potion. Revive Umbreon. And Hyper Potion again. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Next is Bruno. Usually leads with an Onyx. He might not this time, though. Um, let's just go with Tortadle. Actually. Let's get crazy. Let's lead with Flychu. This could be a mistake. But I want to see what happens. Ooh-ha! Did you better? Okay. Oh wait, are you water? I think you're water. I don't know, in my head I was like, yeah, it's dark fighting, but now I'm thinking it might be water fighting. It is water fighting, there you go. It's about to use Steelix. 
Okay. Let's go for the turtle. And we'll try and drown this boy. Okay, well done. Cobra Llama, oh my god. I'm get well I'm guessing you're a fighting type. You know what? This is this is why we have the dazzling gleam. This is what it's for. Beautiful. Beautiful. Hitmonchan. Alright, let's now keep this Gleam train gleamin'. Beautiful. Blue, blue, blue. Critical hit. And my champ. Yeah, I was worried about that. Oh, that I was not expecting. Okay. Uh, oh, yes. Beautiful. Okay, that's Bruno down. Nobody fainted from that one. So we're doing better. <laughs> That objectively went better. Okay, one more. Alright, three more to go. God, what the heck is Agatha gonna have? Are you gonna be a shift to dark types, maybe? She tends to have poison types. Let's put Guardia in front. Dazzling Gleam can work against Dark types as well. I need to remember that. Let's... Let's just try it out. I'll show you how a real trader fights. Annihilate. Okay. Ghost fighting. Um, Breon? Pray he doesn't go for fighting move? Let's try it. Even if he does, Umbreon's pretty tanky. Okay. It's going for Rock Slide for some reason. This is fine. That's going to hurt. But not enough. Crow that. Okay, we're going to fly to this. Is Dark still good against Ghost? Well, yeah, it was super effective against that. What am I thinking? Um... I don't know what I'm thinking. I'm thinking about seven different things at once. And I'm slightly stressed out by being underleveled. We're doing well though, like we're not, like, we still have to think about what we're doing, but this isn't like hard, you know what I mean? Gengar, okay. Oops. That's not what I meant to do. Um. All right, Flycher. <gasps> I'm the greatest Pokemon player of all time. That was a hundred percent intentional. <laughs> that was great. That was great. 
I'm the best. I'm so good at this. <laughs> I definitely left him in intentionally. So that I could fly and dodge the explosion. That's definitely what happened. Okay, Umbreon. Let's Dazzling Gleam. <laughs> that was hilarious. To totally planned. Totally planned. Alright, my special's down. That's gonna hurt. Oof. Oh! She's trying this. You think you can out cheese me, Agatha? Gengar. I mean. <laughs> Surely not, right? Surely not. Okay. <laughs> okay. You're gonna go for Dream Eater now. Okay, no he's not. Oh yeah, nah, that's... That's gonna... <gasps> yes, Gaudia, yes! What is this fight? <laughs> what is this fight? There's no way I should have won that. There is no way I should have won that. That was incredible. That might be... One of the greatest fights in my YouTube career. If you can call it a career, but you know what I mean. That was incredible. Okay. Next is Lance. The explosion. The explosion fly. Oh, man. Hi. Okay. Okay. We're doing fine. It's nine levels higher than us. That's cheating. Lance is cheating. That's what you get for cheating, Lance. Gyarados. Okay, this is Flychu. This has got to be a one-shot, right? Yeah. I'd be concerned if it wasn't. Kingdra! Okay. This is where the Dazzling Gleam is going to really come in handy. I'm running low on them, though. It's that easy, guys. It's that easy. Iguanoch. I don't know what that is, but I'm guessing it's a dragon. So I'm gonna Dazzling Gleam it. <gasps> oh no. Oh no. Oh no! 
<laughs> okay, this is fine. Let's go for Turtle. And we'll hit it with a Blizzard. And we'll hit it with a Blizzard. Critical hit, super effective, of course. Aerodactyl! Mm, this thing's probably faster. Yep. So... We'll go with Flychu. Fire Blast! That's a choice. Burn, of course. Oh! I'm not sure what your plan was, Aerodactyl. But Flycher, you're gonna have to take a hit, buddy. While we bring Nine Tails back. Now, unfortunately, this is Gen 1 Hyper Beam, so because he got the kill, he doesn't need to recharge. This is quite effective, though, so this should. Yeah, okay. That's Lance. That is Lance. One more to go. Alright. Uh, what, what am I doing? Revive. Hyper Potion. And I may as well use this Aether. I don't know if Dazzling... Oh, he's, he's got... No, he doesn't. Never mind. Um, <coughs> I was about to say he has Umbreon. No, he doesn't. I picked Umbreon as my starter. Um, but we may as well just restore Dazzling Gleam. Okay, I wasn't going to save in case I got stuck, but... Oh, well... <laughs> I better not lose this! You know what? Someone, someone can be mad at me, if they really want to. We're gonna... Quick save. <laughs> it's fine, guys. It's fine. Now you're gonna lead with the Sand Slash. Yep. That's why I'm leading with Nine Tails. It's ten levels higher. <laughs> this is gonna take two hits, surely. <gasps> yes, Nine Tails. Yes. Okay, Alakazam. Alright, do we try some some cheese, or do we just go for it? I reckon we just go for it. Okay, we're fine. We do have rest as well, so... In a pinch we can do that. Okay, Executor. Ooh. Let's stay in. Okay, he's charging. Oh no! You can tank this though, right, Umbreon? Yeah, you can!
Yeah! Okay. Three down. Nine tails. It's a regular nine tails. Uh, Guardia. Champion. Champion of the Gengar. You've got this. You can tank a Fire Blast, Guardia. You can do it. I believe in you. Come on, Gaudia. Come on, Gaudia. No! <laughs> yeah, there it goes. Oh, Gaudia, no! <clears throat> okay. Um, this is fine. Let's... Flychu's pretty quick. Let's just go with Flychu. Cloyster, fly to you, we're just gonna keep you in. <laughs> this is fine. Alright. Finally, his Gorachu. Oh, and I've lost... We've... I mean, we could use a revive. Let's see... Let's see how Ninetales with Dig does. We have revives. Worst case scenario. We'll throw some revives out. Oh? I don't know, man. We're, we're kind of doing it. We are the champions, my friend. And to think I was worried. To think I was worried. Why? Why did I lose? I never made any mistakes raising my Pokémon! Green! So you won! Congratulations! You're the new Pokémon League champion! Blue? You were close! <laughs> He's like... His own grandson. He's just like, I'm so disappointed in you. Oak is, like, one of the best characters in this franchise. Just because he's such a dick. And it's great. Alright. Let's see him. Alolan Ninetales carried our way through the Elite Four as I knew it would. <laughs> Flychu! The best. The, the goodest boy. The goodest boy. Totaddle! Totaddle is the best- the best big turtle. Of all- the king of the big turtles. Guardia, champion. Champion of the Gengar. And the best- the ultimate boner boy. <laughs> With the Foghorn of Doom. Nidorain! Bringing the Nidorain of Terror. And finally... The one that started it all, our little Umbreon, actually did some cool stuff in that fight as well. And green! Pokedex rating. Good, you're trying hard. Get an item finder for my aid. Nah, I'm good. Alright, here are the credits. Um, don't leave, I am going to do one tiny little bit of the post game when the credits are done. But as the credits are going, let's... I, I, I'm just going to reiterate what I've said last video and just gradually throughout this series. This ROM hack is awesome. Like, it strikes such a good balance between 
it's not just throwing all of this crazy stuff that it's like, it's completely unrecognizable. It's Pokemon Red. It makes the bare minimum of changes to the original 151. Um, like, it didn't change... It, it updated them with the Pokemon Yellow movesets, but other than that, it didn't change their stats, it didn't change up their move pools, it didn't change the type effectiveness of the old types, it didn't update moves to be the newer, better versions. It left all that stuff exactly how it was, and then just went, hey, here's some new stuff. Here's new types. Here's um, regional forms and evolutions and pre-evolutions and just restored glitch Pokemon. Like, man. Oh, shout outs to Carapthor, man. I love Carapthor. Why is Carapthor not a real Pokemon? Because it is so good. Um, yeah, my hat is off to Plague Von Karma and the entire Kanto expansion pack team. This is easily my favorite Gen 1 mod. Um, it might be one of my favorite mods that I've played at all, to be, fr to be, to be frank. Um, it's just, it's, it's so good. Oh, and then they, they've added themselves at the end of the credits. That's good. That's good. Um, but man, just such a, such a good time. And I am going to show you one little tease of the post game. There, there is quite a little bit in there. And again, I encourage you to play this for yourselves. Check out the post game. Use a different team than me. You use all the cool, the cool secrets that was a cool bit of music, actually. I like that. Um, the little touches. The bringing the, the music from Pokemon Gold and Crystal for the Team Rocket fights was just really cool. Um, okay, video game. Let's, let's jump back in. <laughs> let's jump back in. And <laughs> this actually took longer than I thought. It's already been over half an hour. All right. Also, just the <laughs> the running shoes. Just just the running shoes. Green. Good morning. I'm so proud of you, dear. You've grown so much. Oh, I nearly forgot. I received this letter from Silvco. What does it say? Dear Green, you are cordially invited to my greatest event. I call it the Silf Gauntlet. I have called the greatest trainers in all of Kanto, stronger than even the Elite Four. You will come to Silco, yes? See you then, Chief. So yeah, there's an entire, like, boss rush gauntlet mode. Um, there's a whole plot point. Um, there's another little subplot. Um, are my Pokemon healed? No. Oh, mother. <laughs> mother dearest. Yeah, there's another subplot, which I'm going to, to show you how to unlock, but I'm not going to actually play it. Um, there's Galarian forms of the regional birds that you can go out and catch. Um, there's a whole bunch of stuff. Right now, though, um, this is probably going to be a disaster. And look, if it does, if we lose, we lose. I'm not going to try it again, but we are just going to show you. I think he's up here somewhere. There he is. Ah, yes, Green. Good to see you. The last time we met here, you didn't even have your first Pokémon. Anyway, Green, your League Pokemon League challenge has reignited a spirit that left me a long time ago. How about we spar a bit? What say you? Back in my day, I was a serious trainer. Prepare yourself. We're fighting Professor Oak. My understanding is... His Tauros has a really good moveset, so this is probably not going to go well. He has Earthquake, which is quite effective against Unhitherate. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Now I am scared. Alright, let's... Let's try Umbreon, actually. Let's... Let's try the cheese. Let's try the cheese, because cheese, cheese is good. We can tank earthquakes as well, which is very nice. Um, he's got Blizzard. Tauros is special is not that good, right? So Blizzard's not going to hit hard. Oh, Blizzard doesn't hit hard at all. We can tank one more hit of something. Unless he does that. Great, okay, never mind. I, I, can't, I can't be quite as cheesy as I had planned. Um, 
Flychu can... Ch oh, you have Earthquake, don't you? But I'm faster? Why are you going for Blizzard? You silly little man. Maybe that's why. <laughs> Maybe that's why. Joke's on you. I have full restores and I'm not afraid to use them. Boo. Oh, you know what? You're not going to take poison damage this turn, are you? Because you're going to get a knockout. <gasps> Fly Choo. He's the best in the world. <laughs> Magnazone! Alright. Let's go with Guardia. Oh my god, he's still got five Pokemon left, doesn't he? <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Super effective. Bone Meringue. No, it's not as good as Earthquake. Nido King. I'm gonna try this. He's gonna go first. That is, that isn't near too hard. Oh man, See, why didn't you just do that the first time? Yeah, there he goes. Alright, um... Totodl. I do have revives. <gasps> right, we're part grass! <laughs> I'm like, why isn't this hurting me? Send out a water type next, please. That is not a water type. Ooh. No, we'll go we'll go nine tails. I was gonna say I do have blizzard though, but no, let's just do this. You can tank a hyper beam, right, nine tails? Yeah. Charizard. Slash. I think we're going to use a, a heal up between turns. It's not looking good, but I think we're okay. This is going to hit for neutral. My guy. Oh man, he's faster, I forgot. Okay, no, this, is, this, is, this is fine. This is fine, let's... <laughs> we are faster again. Hmm. To be on the safe side, <laughs> I'm going to revive someone. Flychu.
Drat. Okay. I need a max revive, but I don't have any. Um... Use Solar Beam again, please. <gasps> oh! The crit! We were so close. We were so close. But you know what, friends? Sometimes that's just how it goes. Sometimes that's just how it goes. Well, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for checking out this episode of the Kanto Expansion Pack. Thank you for checking out the series. Please let me know down below what you thought of it. Um, I get the impression people liked it. I got a lot of good feedback on it. Next week, we're going to start a playthrough of Pokemon TCG Neo, which is a mod of Pokemon TCG for the Game Boy. Uh, that replaces all- it's it, the same story, you put the same NPCs, all of that is exactly the same. But they have replaced all of the cards with, uh, cards from the Gen 2 era from the card game. So from, like, Neo Genesis to whatever the last Neo set was. Um, with the emphasis on the Gen 2 mons themselves. I'm pretty keen to check it out. Um, hopefully you guys are too, and I look forward to seeing you then. If not, if you're like, nah, I'm just here for the Kanto thing, I'm bowing out. Totally understandable. Have a nice day. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna do it for me. Thank you so much, guys. Like, subscribe, ring the ding -a and I'll see you next time. Bye! Play this game. What's up, guys? This is Bombman2205. Welcome back to the Kanto Expansion Pack one final time! <coughs> <coughs> Well, we'll do that again.